So let me show you some more problems which are based on the solving linear equations. So we'll see here one question. For example, solve 2x plus 3, 2x plus 3 by 3x plus 4. So this is in denominator place also, these are variables. And 2x minus 3 divided by 3x minus 2. Okay. So 2x plus 3 by 3x plus 4 is equal to 2x minus 3 by 3x plus 3x minus 2. Now we know the question is giving like this. This you need to go for directly cross multiplication method. So when you do directly cross multiplication, so solution, first fraction numerator into second fraction denominator. So that is uh, 2x plus 3 into 3x minus 2 okay, is equals to, now second fraction numerator into first fraction denominator. So 2x minus 3 into 3x plus 4. Now, equal symbol is asked is both sides we need to simplify first. LHS and RHS will simplify after doing cross multiplication. Then, so you already learned in previous chapters, whenever problems are like this, first term will take, multiply the first term. Again, we'll take the first term and multiply the second. Similarly, second term with the first, again, second term with second. Okay, when you do this process, 2x into 3x is uh, 6x squared. And 2x into minus 2 is minus 4x. Okay, that is the first term. And second term is 3. Again, second term multiplies total expression of the second. 3 into 3 is 9x. And 3 into minus 2 is minus 6. Right? Similarly, we can do the same side for RHS also. So 6x squared. 2x into 4 is plus 8x and minus 9x minus 12. So that I wrote. You can see this. Now, whenever it's an equal symbol in the middle, both sides are same, we can cancel. So same values are there, we can cancel either sides. 6x square, 6x square can cancel both sides. LHS and RHS is same. So we can cancel that and simplify the remaining terms. This is minus 4. Here is plus 9x, this is not minus 9x. We should not cancel. Same side only we can cancel if a different side. Okay, same side on both sides. Now minus 4x plus 9x is a 5x minus 6. 8x minus 9x is minus x minus 12. So after simplification, we can go for transposing rule. That is 5x minus x is a plus x LHS and minus 12 already is there. Minus 6 is or right side is plus 6. Okay, 6x is equals to minus 12 plus 6 is minus 6. Then we can do divide the same number both sides. So what we should do according to the problem, we need to divide with 6 by 6. Okay, 6x cancel. x is equal to minus 6 by 6 is minus 1. Right? Okay. So this way we can solve in this. Hence x is equal to 1. And see one more question. So these are the sample problems, you can do similarly, any question is, you should know the method, then you can solve easily. Now next problem is only denominator is given some variables, 5 by x plus 2 minus 3 by x minus 2 is equals to 2 by x, right? So let's see uh, how to solve this. Now we can do this sort of LCM. Like, if you don't know, this is the formula. Actually, LHS is some A by B plus C by D. If it is there, we can write this A into D plus B into C by B D. Okay, first fraction numerator, second fraction denominator. Again, cross it multiply by denominator because it's a plus symbol in between. So, this uh, method or this concept you can follow here. Because x plus 2 and x minus 2 denotes are different. So 5 into x minus 2, whatever sign, if it is a plus or minus means plus or minus will come. Minus means minus will come in between. And 3 into here is x plus 2. Okay. 
So, and divide by both denominators x plus 2 into x minus 2. You can multiply that is equals to 2 by x. Then, uh, next is similarly same uh, problems like other sums. We can open the bracket, so we should multiply. So, 5 into x is 5x minus 5 to the 10. This is minus 3 into x is minus 3x minus 3 to the 6. By we can simplify it. This is the formula actually you remember a plus b into a minus b a square minus b square. So we can multiply there is x square minus 2 square. So that is 4 is equals to 2 by x. If you multiply also so normally take first term and this both terms you get the same answer. Then simplify 5x minus 3x is 2x minus 10 minus 6 is minus 16 by x squared minus 4 is equals to 2 by x is RHS. That's it. Now we can do a cross multiplication because two fractions. If you do cross multiplication, yes, this is a x into 2x minus 16 and 2 into x squared minus 4. Simplify this 2 into x, 2x into x is x, 2x squared minus 16x is minus 16x here is 2x squared minus 2 4 is 8 so as I explained just any term is same LHS and RHS we can go for cancellation so plus 2x squared plus 2x squared cancel then minus 16x is equals to minus 8 so to get the x value this is minus 16 into x okay when you read like that so you should divide with minus 16 both sides so divide with minus 16 both sides then you can cancel so x is equals to minus by minus plus 8 by 16 is 1 by 2 x is equals to 1 by 2 that's it so you can simplify in this way right. and show you one more question okay i'll take one problem uh, decimals let me solve one problem with the decimals in linear equation for example, 1.25 plus 9.75 by x is equals to 4.5. So this is a simple linear equation. Now we can transposing rule because 1.25 is number. We can transpose to right side. So this value to transpose other side with changing sign. Okay, then you will see the solution. So 9.75 by x is equals to 4.5 minus 1.25. So 4.5 you can write 4.50. 4.50 minus 1.25 is 3.25. 3.25. Then 9.75 by x we got 3.25 by there is no denominator just put as 1 okay then just two fractions either sides LHS and RHS then we have to go for cross multiplication when you do this x into 3.25 is equals to 9.75 into 1 is 9.75 then we can divide with the same number both sides divide by 3.25 divide by 3.25 so this cancel rs 3.25 directly if you take right side we divide so same method x is equals to 9.75 by 3.25 this you can write 975 by 325 because after point this number of decimals are same you can use table 325 ones are 325 threes are because it is a 9 25 threes are 75 right it's coming like that so x is equal to 3 any question if you convert into the fractions both sides you can do cross multiplication if it is only single terms you can use uh, transposition rules okay this way we can solve any uh, simple equations also by using the rules. So main rules is by transposing as well as cross multiplication and same number 
you can take the same number on dividing, multiplying, adding, subtracting also both sides value will not change. And we'll, I'll show you some word problems also which are related to the linear equations now. 